is up everybody what is up everybody today i'm gonna show you how to get all the stones in pokemon sun and moon so in pokemon sun and moon they made a new stone called the ice stone and also yeah so the ice stone and also some other stones but they're not new but since as the sunstone the moonstone you can get you can like get like one per game but there's also another way you can get more of them this is right now helping me complete the Pokédex. I'm not done with it, but I'm getting very close to it. I'm more than halfway there. A lot more than halfway there. But I'm going to show you how to get more stones. So first, you're going to have to have this right here. Poké Paluga. I know, I'm gonna, I know I say that wrong. I just don't really know how to pronounce it that well. So you got to have this. So after you have this, go into it. My thing is fully leveled up to it. Oh, Max. Okay. So, so it's going to start off with this screen right here. I already fully upgraded all of them, but when you get here, do the Pokemon stuff and, and try to unlock this one as soon as you can. If you, But at the, if you're at the, the end of the game, you can just do this all. But uh, if you're like in the middle of the game, I say you just start doing it right now. And if you're not in the middle of the game, just start doing it. Start, start doing this because um here you can get um more stones such as moon stones, ice stones, fire stones, water stones, all of them. But some of them you can buy. Um, no, I'm not gonna place any Poke Beans in there. I only have 14, 44 minutes in. But if I go, I'm not gonna recall them back yet. No, I don't want to recall them back. But you must have this path right here, okay? This um this gem path right here. You need to have access to this one. It's like the second one after the um path where you can get stars for bottle caps. Those things are useful. But if you get if you can get those and then you can um start getting stones. Hold on, let me exit out of here. Because I got so I got a lot of stones from it, like moonstones and sunstones from my items. Hold on, let me find them real quick. Okay, hold on, let me find one. Okay, here is fire stone. I did not buy these actually. I'm being completely honest. I did not buy these. I just have them because of it. Some things I already can buy stuff. Don't really care. Oh yeah, here are some moonstones. I have two mo moonstones. I used to have four, but I already used them, or maybe five. But I used them on Pokemon to evolve them. But yeah, because you can only like get around like one moonstone, I think. I'm not hundred percent sure, but I know you can. I know you can get around like one moonstone. So I got two, and I and I had a couple more, but I already evolved Pokemon with it. So that's how I got those. And then I got six ice stones that are just right here I don't really use because, I don't know, I don't really have Pokemon to evolve them with because I think there's only two. Yeah, there's only two. So yeah, this is how you get all the stones in Pokemon Sun and Moon. It will probably take you a while. So I say when you first get it, just start doing it. So that means when you beat the game, when you beat the whole game, you can start catching every Pokemon in Pokemon Sun and Moon. And you will also have the stones to evolve Pokemon. That means you don't have to go on GTS or trade people. So anyways, guys, I just wanted to make a video. I'm sorry I did not make a video in a long time. I've been doing other stuff. But I just wanted to make a video real quick about how to get the stones. I'm going to do another video when I complete the Pokedex. And bye.